what is it with the San Francisco 49ers and its quarterbacks? You got knocked out of a playoff game, Brandon. Yeah, sakes. I did. I, I the, the Packer championship game. Yeah. I had a rib out that no one knew about. I found out two weeks later. They popped it back in. I'm like, oh, I feel great. <laughs> I'm like, oh. So, but it was, that game just disappeared last week and it was hard. It felt for me even hyped, like I don't, it's been a lot of years since I saw a game that just felt like mm -hmm. it was that big. And so it just disappeared. But man, I love this team. I love these guys. Uh, I love the story. I love the coaching that can create this environment where, oh yeah, quarterback goes down, we're, we're fine. Well, we're fine again, we're fine. And it's just, it elevates the people who come in to kind of participate. So I, I just, I love this team. The fans want to know, Okay, so what does Shanahan do at quarterback now? He's got to wait six months before he gets to see what Purdy can do, and then you got by then, Trey Lance will be ready to go. It looks like Trey will be ready, mm -hmm. no doubt. I feel it's that sure. way. And uh, we've made that commitment, so that's that's our that could be plan A at the moment. Mm -hmm. And then if Brock can get healthy and kind of reclaim his spot, because I think he claimed it. I mean, he put a stake in the top of Everest. I thought he was really amazing. And I think that they just play that out. They're both not toxic personalities. That locker room is locked in. They they love them both, and we'll just figure it out. But if you know, I think the biggest thing right now is can Brock get back to play this season? And if not, then they've got to. You can't go in with just one quarterback, so they have to do something. But if they can get them both back healthy, um, I think we're kind of covered. Last one for me. For all those that are just kind of all over Shanahan for whatever reason. I mean, Steve three NFC Championship games in the last four years. I mean, that's nothing to shake at. I, I don't know how to say this more forcefully. <laughs> like, the, you've got to stop. Yeah. You have no idea what you're talking about. This is the, that there's three or four geniuses in the NFL, this generation, mm -hmm. he's one of them. So, like, knock it off. You want to peck at him just for fun? That's just life. But if you're actually going to substantively come at him that he can't, you know, he doesn't know what he's doing. I've said many times, if I could pick anywhere in the league right now, and I'm not because I'm a 49er for life, but if I could pick anywhere on step back and say, where do you want to play? I'm telling you, I want to play in this offense with these guys, with that coach.